Hello and welcome back to another SQL tutorial. This is video number 22nd of the series. Now in last video we learned about some function and we learned that addition of null values. These are null values here. There is one null value here. We learned that addition of null values can be a bit more daunting. So today's lesson is to understand null values in a bit more detail. In null value and zero means two different things. 0 is a value which can be added, subtracted and multiplied with simple mathematical rules. A null value in a column does not mean that the value is 0. A null simply indicates that the value is either absent or not known. So in last video we learned the use of coalesce function in order to convert null values into zeros and then we argued that while using some function the SQL was ignoring some of the values. So let me prove that it was actually ignoring some of the values. So when we were adding sum of all values in salary column and sum of all values in commission column together, the query was actually ignoring these rows where commission is null. So let me prove that uh, that is actually the case. So let me show you if I say select sum bracket open cell plus commission bracket close from EMP where EMP and O say for example 1003 1003 and if I run this you will actually have a value which will be an addition of $7,500 plus $500 so the answer should be $8,000 so select this and then run and the value is $8,000 now try and run similar query for a row where the commission is null so the answer should be say for example employee number 1000 the query is same the difference is that this employee has a salary of $5,000 and the commission is null so null plus a value is always null. So if there was a zero here, this value plus zero would be $5,000. Let me prove that. Select some plus commission from, from EMP where EMP and O is 1000 and the total is null. So that was the problem that was happening in last video. And we learned how to, how to handle this problem with the help of coalesce function and we can also run a query group by department number some salary from EMP and we'll say group by department number so run this and you have this is the correct figure this figure is not right so the total sum of salary plus commission in department number 10 is $28,800 versus the query is resulting in null value for the employees of department number 20 which is not right so you'll have to use coalesce function which we used in last video if you haven't seen the last video go back and uh, watch video number 21 thank you very much